welkom bij Sederberg. I just arrived at my next stop over. Sederberg Guest Farm. Now the last seven kilometers bad road, but definitely worth traveling. Road, no stop and go. Couple of bottles, not too bad. And it was quite a pleasant drive coming here from Coxstadt. There's no specific stands or sites marked. Park anywhere there in that area. If you want in the sun. In this area there, some shade, some sun. Good morning, Saturday morning. Overcast. I haven't checked the weather forecast this morning, so I've got no idea what's going to happen, but as far as I remember from yesterday, it's going to clear just now and it's going to be a sunny day. like a sausage dog but it's a spring dog hammerhead spring dog okay, in my early morning hike this morning I was surprised to come across some dinosaur remains and I didn't know there was any anything like that in this area but uh, yeah quite fascinating hot and sunny all morning and then all of a sudden a dark cloud moved over you can hear the rain approaching but otherwise all the way around blue skies and there it's coming down I don't know how long this is going to last, but it's raining pretty hard now. And then it was over. <laughs> Lasted about 10 minutes. And now the sun is out again. In blue skies. morning, Sunday morning, Misty, 
but it's a little bit of blue sky above above me, so I don't know how long the mist is going to be here before that clears. And today is the day to move on again, go to explore more and go to the next campsite. Just arrived at my next stop over. Just hiding behind the wall. The wind's blowing. And the last 10 or 20 kilometers the wind was really pushing me around. But again, just drive accordingly, got you safe. I'm surprised the roads are in a good condition coming here. And um, being a Sunday, hardly any traffic. But very nice, I haven't walked around, but I've uh, hooked up with electricity. Gonna fill up with water. A pollution block here, yeah, right next to me. Gentleman here from Etabal Lodge just took me up the Barclay Pass to go and show me the tortoise rock. And as we got there, it started pouring down with rain, but it didn't last long. Um, unfortunately, the sun was in the wrong place for decent pictures, but I took a couple of pictures and uh, do, did a bit of a drone shot up there. I came all the way up the Barclay Pass to come and have a look at the tortoise rock. But the rain is coming down. I can't fly the drone and I can't take proper pictures. Now, at least now it stopped raining. Now I can get some picture. The light is not perfect, but uh, there's a tortoise, tortoise rock. And Definitely a sight to see.
Good morning, Tuesday morning. It's a nip in the air, but uh, clear skies. And today is the day to move on again. I'm going to be heading towards the coast again. And let's see what today brings. Just got to my next stop over. The wind was blowing most of the way coming here, but it wasn't that bad. But again, just drove accordingly. But as soon as I stopped here, plugged in and opened the doors, the wind stopped blowing and it's really pumping now. So let's see what uh, later brings and uh, hope the wind's not going to be too bad so I can do a video because there's a lot to video in this place. <coughs> Audio and Visual Museum. Lots of DVDs, videos, LPs, CDs, projectors, lots of cameras. Very interesting. And more and more and more. This camper van is a little bit older than mine. I'm sure if you look around here, <laughs> you'll find stuff that people have been looking for for many years. Good morning, Wednesday morning. There was no wind at all last night. This morning it also still looks pretty good, but a lot of cloud, looks like 100% overcast. Let's see what the weather does later, and again there's so much to see in this place. Paintball! Thomas River Main Road, very busy, about one car per hour. Little village shop, biscuits and chips and sweets, and basic stuff, toothpaste, washing powder, really meal. Lots of little things and more than enough what you would need in this area. Cold drinks, bread, some veggies.
good morning Thursday morning and there's quite a bit of cloud around but the weather forecast predicts open skies and being a hot day today now last night was an absolute stunning sunset I haven't seen red skies like that for a long time that side there was completely red and today is the day to move on again so later today I'll see the sea I'll go right down to the coast and we'll see what the weather's like down there and looking forward to it Just arrived at my next stop over. Gonna be here for a couple of days in Clenmonda just before Port Alfred. And I'm staying over with some family that I haven't seen for many years. So I'll be staying over here and uh, at the moment a bit of a breeze blowing but sunny, no clouds in the sky at the moment. The road wasn't too bad coming here, one or two bad potholes. But um, otherwise, a safe, safe trip here. Definitely a lot warmer here than at the old Thomas River. It was pretty chilly this morning when I left. But here yeah, for a couple of days and enjoy. Cheers. Great Fish Point Lighthouse. Good morning, it's Friday morning, 100% overcast today and we'll just be going around exploring the area a little bit and then tonight I've got a workshop here in Clan Mondo, going to do a paint by light workshop uh, just here at the Pineapple Research Centre, just outside Bathurst not excellent weather but here's a big pineapple Lots of pineapple fields around here. 